think we have a serious problem in our country with corporate consolidation. And you see the evidence of that in how dignity is being stripped from labor. And we have people that work full-time jobs and still can't uh, uh, make a living wage. We see that because consumer prices are being raised by pharmaceutical companies that often have monopolistic holds on drugs. And you see that by just the fact that this is actually a, an economy that's hurting small businesses and not allowing them to compete. Uh, one of the most aggressive bills in the Senate to deal with corporate consolidation is mine about corporate consolidation in the ag sector. So I feel very strongly about the need to check the corporate consolidation and let the free market work. And I'll tell you this, I live in a low income black and brown community. I see every single day that this economy is not working for average Americans. The indicators that are being used from GDP to Wall Street's rankings is not helping people in my community. It is about time that we have an economy that works for everybody, not just the wealthiest in our nation. But quickly, Senator Booker, you did say that you didn't think it was right to name names, to name companies and single them out, as Senator Warren has briefly. Why is that? Well, again, I, I will single out companies like Halliburton or Amazon that pay nothing in taxes and are need to change that. And when it comes to antitrust law, what I will do is, number one, appoint judges that will enforce it. Number two, have a DOJ and a Federal Trade Commission that will go through the processes necessary to check this kind of corporate concentration. At the end of the day, we have too much of a problem with corporate power growing. We see that with everything from Citizens United and the way they're trying to influence Washington. It's about time that we have a president that fights for the people in this country That's time, who sir. need to have someone that's a champion for them.